Patricia? Is that you? Oh my god, I cannot believe you're still working in this hell hall. Oh my god. Do you still live with your parents? Hi, Martha. Good to see you. How are you? Best of all, baby. <laughs> my life is full of love and gold, you know? I drive a Porsche, I wear diamonds, I go to parties, I enjoy life in general, and as always, actually. And I see that you haven't changed at all. Well, at least you removed your braces. <laughs> Back then in college, you looked like a scarecrow, and your mouth was full of old fans. Scary to look at. Yeah, exactly. I told you, if you had dressed up, made your hair, made a plastic surgery, you wouldn't have to work either, but I know it's too late to change anything. Your age. You're the same age, Martha. <laughs> yes, but look at me and look at yourself. You see? I mean, come on, I have spas, I have beauty salons, I have plastic surgery. And what do you have? Boxes, warehouses, hard labor? <laughs> Seriously? I mean, you see, I'm a goddess. Even now, I can try to bali, drink a cocktail, have a palm tree for a month. They all be Can I offer you some tea? Coffee better. Okay, coffee then. Oliver? Yeah? Can you bring some coffee, please? Of course. Hello. Sugar? Milk? Uh, seriously? I have latte. Lactose-free, skim milk with cream. And make sure it's not too hot. Okay, so should cream also be skim? Uh, did I say anything about skim cream? The staff has to be able to listen attentively. Boy. Okay. I recognize the style of this store. All employees are dumb as a rock. Where do your superiors look? Believe me, I was not going to come into this hell hole, but John got an urgent call for work. He owns his own large company. He makes his schedule, you know. But what am I talking about? You will not understand. Sure. I sat in a restaurant at the corner, eating lobsters. I'm sure you have no idea about these expensive restaurants. Anyway, in short, I decided to have some fun while he finishes his business. So I ended up here still crazy. I cannot imagine that you're working here. As you can see. Here you are. Your latte, skim milk, lactose-free, creamy, without froth, not too mm, hot. Yeah, not too hot. It's cold. I won't drink it. Martha, can I show you our new collection? Wow, you have a new collection? I wonder who are these nameless design geniuses? Miss, would you like to try on something? Are you kidding me? To try on? I'm afraid these cheap fabrics will give my skin a rash. I assure you that all the fabrics at the store are natural. Cotton, silk, linen. Is it a collection for construction workers or what? Where are the hats? At the other side of the room. actually. Listen, um, let's be quick because we have a hot bath in our hotel room. John? Okay. Uh, What's going on? Who is this woman? Um, listen, what are you doing here? I thought you were g going home after lunch. John, you haven't answered my question. Who is this woman? Oh, I'm Jessica. Nice to Keep meet you. Keep your clothes away from me. Now listen, uh, honey. Go pick a dress, and I'll deal with this crazy woman myself, all right? Sure. Oh, crazy woman? H am I crazy woman? John, you still haven't answered me. Who is this woman? Would you please shut your mouth. I don't need your scandal. I don't need your this breakdown. Eat a dolphin or go, just go away. Go away. I don't understand, but what about our engagement? You, you don't care about my feelings. Feelings? Engagement? Come on, are you crazy? This ring, it means nothing. It's a bubble for shutting your mouth. I don't understand, really. Sure you don't understand. Thinking is not your strongest point, does it? Let me be clear. I invest in you. You're my investment. All those dresses, expensive cars, watches, shoes. But, but I thought you'd love me. <laughs> love? Do you even believe in love? Come on. Those are beneficial relationships. Here. Take this. 
Take this. Now, go take a spa, have a nice dinner or something, and go home. Yes. Nice. Now, baby. Yes. <laughs> say goodbye to the crazy lady. Oh, bye bye. Bye. Martha? What happened? Martha, the way this man treats you is horrible. I know, but what am I supposed to do? How can I live without him if I will not have my previous life I'm used no. to? It's easy for you to say. I mean, you're a nerd. You're an excellent student. You always work. You know what you want, and I... I cannot even take care of myself. Nonsense, Martha, you're smart. You just underestimate yourself. But a person is, first of all, a personality. The looks come second. And you're funny. You know all about fashion. You have your own style and charisma. Do you really think so? Of course. Martha, you have no idea how wonderful you are. Oh, Trisha. I'm so sorry. I was so rude. I came here and I bragged. I, I insulted your work. It's nothing. Please don't cry. Of course I forgive you, Martha. But you should know that the most beautiful things in life can come only from your own labor. The food is tasteless if someone else pays for it. There is no beauty in clothes if they are bought at someone else's expense. There is no joy on vacation if you don't deserve it for your work. Yes, the career path is difficult, but at the same time, it's beautiful. Ten years ago, I came to this store as a college student. I had no skills or experience. Of course, I had to learn everything from scratch. At first, I worked in a dirty warehouse carrying boxes of clothes. Then I brought coffee and learned to understand the desires of clients. I had to learn how to work with stuff on my own mistakes. Then I achieved my goal and became a director. Martha, this is my story. And from my own experience, I can tell you that anything is possible if you really want it. Do you really think I can get away from John and start my life from scratch? Of course, and you will succeed. I'll help you. You can work for me. Oh, Trisha, thank you so much. But I only have one request. Are you ready? Yes. I'm proud of you.